talk about that late finish it, 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 the regulation you guys found and five, six, seven points and then kept giving away and then tied it that yeah, I thought our poise down the stretch and playing from behind I thought was really good. Maybe as good as it's been all year for us. Um, you know, you don't, you don't have to have a three or a two in that situation when you're down multiple possessions. But you do need to play with efficiency and, and some sort of pace. And I thought our guys were able to execute um, and make big shots. The, the, the one thing that I wanted to say, regardless of whatever the other questions are, um, I think um, losing uh, Josh Smith and losing, I don't know how to properly pronounce his last name, number 55, I think that's really, really hard to overcome. That, that would be like us losing Devontae Gardner and Todd Mayo uh, midseason uh, with the production that those guys have given Georgetown. Um, I've always had great respect for, for Coach Thompson, but um, you look at the stretch that they've been through, and I think the numbers are going to bear it out. We'll see how it plays itself out, but it's becoming incredibly hard to win on the road in this league. And so you look at the schedule that they've played over the last two weeks and the things that have transpired with their roster, those two things combined, um, that's, that's extremely difficult. Coach, for you, the balance on school of offense, five players, double figures, those, how much difference does that make for balance? In the well, that helped. Um, I would say that's probably the most balance um, that we've had in a long time. I thought Devontae was much more efficient. Obviously, John and Steve uh, had their career games in regards to their production, but also to the what they brought to the team. I thought how Derek handled 